When you run out of ammo, don't wave an empty handgun in their face. If simply bearing the switch shovel doesn't end the confrontation, this edge here, which chopped through a two by four in under a minute, is that it? I can't do that with a machete. And a machete is much larger than this. And it really is politically incorrect to carry a machete on your person or in your car. The hardware on this shovel is grade eight. Aircraft is grade five, automotive grade three. This is the hardware used in the space shuttle. What's that doing on a shovel? Well we're about to see. Besides being a shovel, uh, it is a boat paddle, obviously, and we have used it as such. Uh, it is obviously an axe, as we just demonstrated on the 2x4. It is also a pick. Go ahead. It, you tighten it at 45 degrees with a little blade until it's steady. You put this under the, the thing you want to lift and lift it up. That's good. This shovel is also a grappling hook. I take the shovel, loosen the nut. I turn it down to 45 degrees up from the handle. And I put that corner in the chamfer in the middle of the nut. I wiggle that to get it well centered and that's a grappling hook that will easily hold my weight scaling a wall or, 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 or going into a second story window. And if, if you'll look up here, I will take the grappling hook here and hook it over this rafter. up here, however you are using your line up on that, reach up, and obviously the shovel is holding my whole weight. Okay, done. This shovel is a hoe for all the loose stuff in life. If you watch, It is also, uh, if that work makes you feel tired, it is a chair, a comfortable chair. I've sat on it for many hours. If nature calls, you dig a little hole with the shovel and sit over to the right or left and you have a porta potty. Another practical position for this shovel. You're out hunting, you bag a couple of rabbits, you don't want to build a campsite because you don't want to carry the bodies home and you're not killing for killing's sake, you're killing for survival. You take your shovel, you bend the blade and the handle at 90 degrees, thusly, tighten the nut, settle the blade down into the ground and take some canned heat like this or a single burner stove, Coleman or, or military, and put your pot on there and cook, boil, fry, whatever you want to do. The same position for the stove, if you invert it like this, settle this into the ground, if you are shooting prone, this is eminently more stable than this would ever be. In all positions of this shovel, there's only one thing main thing to remember. Whatever position you put the shovel in, you tighten the nut. Then you wiggle the blade. When I stop to rest, I make sure the nut is stay, stays tight and the shovel is virtually indestructible. So we have the E-Tool, the U.S. military shovel, the finest belt utility tool and self-defense weapon uh, ever built by man, many have said. If uh, this shovel is just a shovel. It's just a shovel. Carry it in your car, check in your luggage at the airport, take it anywhere in the world. This shovel is not a threat to anyone who is not a threat to you. And this is the real one from the U.S. military made by the Ames Company. Thank you.